welcome back to Hi Mama's online activity content hub. My name is Kaya and I'm an early childhood educator here at Hi Mama headquarters. For today's activity, we're going to be talking about feelings. This is a really great activity for toddlers who are just learning about their feelings and the different types of feelings, especially overwhelming feelings like anger and frustration. This is a really great activity to help them practice how to manage those feelings and why those feelings happen in the first place. For this activity, you're just going to need a couple things. I've got a handheld mirror here. So when we're doing this activity, it's really important to have a mirror accessible so that the child can actually see what that feeling looks like on their face. And you're also gonna need one of our printables. These cards here are a memory matching game. So once you talk about the feelings, there's a little bit of a game element in this as well by having the child match the cards together. So angry goes with angry, happy goes with happy, proud goes with proud, etc. So for this activity, we're going to print out our printable and cut each of the squares out, just like that. You can start this activity by opening up the conversation, maybe reading some books about how we feel, what we do when we're angry, what types of things make, make us angry, and how we can manage those emotions. The conversation can go about happy, proud, sad, excited, many, many different types of feelings there. What you're gonna do for this activity is first, we're gonna pull out a card here. So if you're explaining this happy emotion to your child, you would want the child to show them your, their happy face. So you can show them your happy face and they can reciprocate that back as well by looking in the mirror and seeing what that sees that looks like on them. After that, you're gonna give them the card and have them match it to whichever card they think it matches to. So by looking at the expression on their card here, they're going to find the expression that matches the child on the other card. There we go. And you can continue that talking about the different feelings and expressions, how they feel in the certain situations, and having them match each card on the memory plate down here. Thank you all so much for tuning in today. I hope you enjoyed the activity and we will see you very soon. Bye.